Republican Road Rule, after days of yelling at guards, talking about what he thinks is going on in the jail, recording license plates. Well, tonight he thought he finally had something and he called the police. He had Randy Ireland, known from the J6 vigils, show up and coach him through how to keep talking, keep pressing, talk to a supervisor, keep going, keep going. And I believe it was well over an hour waiting, but they did come out to talk to him and the end result was an arrest. Yep. <laughs> I mean, flop around and find out, I guess. Uh, basically, they said that he assaulted the officer. Um, I don't know what basis they went off of. It was his explanation he kept giving. If they had maybe uh, security camera footage, if they went back on his stream and watched the earlier content and not just the segment that he showed, I don't know. Um, now, DC is not a bail city. Like, they don't have bail. So he's either going to get out or they're going to hold him. He's most likely just going to get out. But uh, yeah, that was some excitement for the night. And there is an issue, though, because Randy Ireland and all the J6 people, other than Mickey, Mickey didn't go. A lot of the J6 uh, vigil people were there. Are they going to get roped into this? Is it going to affect their permit? Is the Because, I mean, let's be honest, every guard in that facility that he's yelled at is probably going to file some form of a complaint after tonight. So this could have repercussions and that wouldn't have happened if he just walked away and wasn't prodded by Randy Ireland to keep going. Realistically, that could be what causes a ton of issues for them.